In this video, we're going to be looking for missing angles. And these are ones where we haven't drawn them accurately. Uh, we need to use our ingenuity, if you will. So, we have problems where we have angles in a right angle. We've got problems where we've got angles on a straight line. And we've got problems where we've got angles at a point. For each of these, you need to know what the sum would have to be. Now we know from the first video in this set that these angles, because that is a right angle, must add up to 90 degrees. So if they both add up to 90 degrees, then we can work out the missing angle. x plus 65 must be 90. So take the 65 from 90, leaves you with 25 degrees. So x must be 25 degrees. Now, for this second problem, we know that angles on a straight line must add up to 180 degrees. So, the three angles must add to make 180. Well, 45 and 20 is 65. So, 180 take away the 65 will get you to 115. So y is 115 degrees. And then in the third example, if you've got angles around a point, then they must add up to 360 degrees. So the three angles must add up to 360. So 130 plus 70 is 200. So take 200 away from 360 and you get left with 160 degrees. So Z is 160. So you need to know these three cases. Angles in a right angle must add up to 90, angles on a straight line must add up to 180, and angles around a point must add up to 360. And using that fact, well, these three facts, you can solve these types of problems.